AI influencer is not a new word anymore. You will find tons of tutorial videos on YouTube about how to make virtual influencers with various AI tools. In today's video, I will dive into Dipper. I'm going to share the method of changing the facial expression of AI influencers. Let's dive in. Photoshop can be used to change the facial expression of any model on Photoshop, but there is a catch. It demands high expertise with a huge time. And to solve this issue, a few days ago I started searching for AI tools that can do it. And guess what? I found it, and today I am going to introduce it to you. Introducing HeyPhoto AI, a 100% free AI image manipulation platform. With this tool, you can change gaze direction, nose shape, skin tone, age, hairstyle, and other facial features. Not only that, you can even swap faces and create lifelike headshots for your social media profile and many more. Alright, to find HeyPhoto AI, open your browser and search for HeyPhoto AI. After getting the search result, click on the first link. This is the HeyPhoto AI homepage. Now we have to create a free account. Click on the sign up button from here. Now create an account with a mail and password, or continue with Apple, GitHub, Google, or Facebook accounts. Okay, after creating the account, your interface will be like this. Now we have to upload our desired image. I am uploading a random image, and our image has been uploaded. Now let's try how it works. On the left side, you will find the options, and the first option is to look at bird. Here we have this bird here. And what it does, if I drag this bird, you can see her eyes movement is changing. Okay, so if I move it a little bit further, you can see on the left side. So if I move this bird on the right side, you can see her eye movement is changing towards the right side. And if I move this on the upward side, here it looks really, really horrible. And if I move this down a little bit here, you can see now she's looking downwards. But the overuse of this one can also make your images worse. So I would recommend you to go with the very slight movement. So here you can see it looks really, really good here. And you can also see the details on the face. You can see the wrinkles around the eyes. It looks really natural. So this option is also really cool. You can also try this one. But I would like to reset my image because we had to try some other features. So the next one is the anonymize. So these are some kinds of filters that you can apply and it does change your facial expressions just to make your face unrecognizable from the AI detection tools. So we're going to move on to the next tool, which is Smart. And this is a really cool tool, and this is one of my favorites. And here you can see we have our slider here. So if I move this slider towards the left side, it's going to make it look like sad. And if I move this slider to the right side, it will make her face smile. So I'm going to move it a little bit here, and this is now starting the processing. So here you can see a really subtle smile on her face. You can see even the lips are a little bit opened here. So if I move this a little bit more here, and now her face is looking more smiley. And if we look at the details here, you can see the wrinkles around the eyes. It looks really natural. And you guys can also see some kind of the wrinkle lines around her lips. That makes it look natural. And let's say if I move this slider all the way to the right, now you can see it automatically generated the teeth. And it also generated the dimple kind of thing on the left side you can see, and the wrinkle lines that look really, really natural. But it also changed the character a little bit. You can see this is not our original character. It doesn't look like our original character, but it's a really cool feature. And if I move this slider to the left side, you can see the character looks similar. But there is some kind of like sad face here. Okay. So I think the sad face looks way more natural than the smiling face, because the smiling face is generating the teeth. AI is trying to generate the teeth and wrinkles and all that stuff. So it does change the face a little bit. So if you guys don't want to try this feature, we also have the next option, which is emotion. So I'm going to click on that. And you can see we have some emotions here like scared, surprise, happiness, disgust, and anger. So we're going to go with the scared face first. Okay, so look at that. Now she's looking scared. So let's try the surprise. Okay. So the surprised and scared look really similar. And let's try the happy. Okay. So it generated the extra air of the teeth and also made her lips open. But again, it does change the original face. So you can also try the disgusted face here that I don't think it looks like a disgusted face. 
And the next one is the angry. Okay, so it's weird. It's looking somewhere between the angry and the happy. But I think the smile slider works best instead of the emotions here. Alright, the next tool is gender. Here you can customize the face gender. If you slide it to the left side, then it will look like more female characters. And if you slide to the right, then it will be like a male character. Let's try it. It's really a cool feature to make some fun, but not useful for an influencer. But for sure you can use it to make some fun. Okay, the next step is age. You can change the age with this tool. If you slide it to the left, the face will look younger. And if you slide it to the right, then it will look like an older face. You can see that when I change the value, the face is changing. So actually these are some kinds of filters that you can play around with. And I'm not saying that this is as good as the Photoshop version, but it does work well in most of the cases. And it also depends on your input image, right? Always give time to customize the image, then you will get a better result. All right, friends, that's all about the AI Influencer Facial Expression Changer AI tool. All right, friends, I will wrap up our video now. Before that, I would love to hear about your experience with changing facial expressions with AII. Share your thoughts and results in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe to our channel for more amazing tutorials like this one. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, happy creating.